I'm Andrew for Andrew Talks. I'm ready to talk and I hope you're ready to listen. Pen in hand, let's go. The London riots, the stock market crash, the debt ceiling, African famine, more mediation in Japan. Have I missed anything? Yeah, it's been a rough week and it's only Tuesday. It's only Tuesday, it's been a rough week. And it's got me asking, where is the joy? That's right, where is the joy? Everything is going wrong. I know people right now watching, you're at your jobs, maybe you're not happy at your job. You gotta get ready for back to school, whatever the case may be, you're just unhappy. Who wants summer to end? But at the same time, who wants a summer like this? Where is the joy? That's the question I'm asking tonight and this morning on Andrew Talks. Where's the joy? Where's the joy? And where do you find your joy? Uh, you know, for me, personally, there's a couple of things that bring me joy. Number one is a good old-fashioned nap. That's right, you heard me. A good old-fashioned nap. Just a couple of minutes, pillow, face time, makes everything better. And by a couple of minutes, I don't mean like the doctor recommended 20-minute power nap. No, 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 no. I'm hardcore when it comes to naps. I'm talking a good hour 15, people. That's right, get it, and I know what you're saying. Hour 15, who has an hour 15 in the day? If you don't have it like that, it's all right, it's fine. Maybe every week, take yourself a nap. It brings me great joy. It brings the people around me joy, because I'm not crabby all the time. I'm not, I'm happy. I'm happy and I'm positive. Mm -hmm. And I'm able to do Andrew Talks every week, because why? I take a nap. That's right. That brings me joy. And doing Andrew Talks, of course, brings me joy. What else do you say? What else, Andrew, does bring you joy? Funny you should ask. Thank you for asking. Funny you should ask. Um, cooking. Cooking brings me joy. Well, a little less cooking, more so eating. Yeah, uh, I bet you can feel me on that. Nothing wrong with a good old bowl of pasta. I do like uh, skinless chicken tenderloins from now and again. Just saying, a just the peace, the joy, the fun of getting into the kitchen, chopping up a few veggies, and seeing what you come up with brings me joy. Now, the last one that brings me joy, you should already know, because you've seen it a few times here on Andrew Talks, is a good, fun, reckless dance party. That's right. Every day before my other job, and actually before Andrew talks I gotta get hyped up you gotta get ready to go get out that door I crank up the tunes whoever I'm feeling right now it's been Beyonce with that new album 4 shout out to Beyonce you killed it girlfriend you killed it I put that on and then you know the music just gets you going like this uh oh oh see already and then and then Beyonce gotta move like this where she go like this uh oh you ain't ready for it. You ain't ready for it. And then before you know it, just do 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 get it. Do 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 do. See, all right, dance party. It's call me next time, and I'll come over. We can do a dance party together. But it brings me joy. Find something that brings you joy, especially with all these horrible stories I mentioned earlier. I kid you not. I've been online all day today to come up with some stories for you all, for Andrew Talks, for us to discuss. And everything was so depressing. Everything was so painful. Everything was just so blah. I was like, we gotta do something different. We gotta shake it up. We gotta find some joy. I even wore my joyful orange polo. Hope you like it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, wardrobe. And you know, you gotta find the joy. So I want you to take a minute, grab a pen, Grab some paper, write down something that makes you joyful, and then go ahead and do it. Doesn't have to be right now, it doesn't have to be this minute, but this week, promise yourself, you're gonna do something that makes you joyful. So if that's going out fly fishing, go out fly fishing. If that's spending a little money, doing a little retail therapy, go out to the mall. I'm sure it'll help the economy. So go out to that mall, pick yourself up, maybe a new shirt, a new pair of pants, whatever the case may be. If it's just being out in nature, taking a walk, whatever brings you joy, go out there, get some joy, and then that you have some joy, make sure you share it with somebody else. Because the way that the world is going right now, we need a big old dose of joy, honey. And I am going to be the pharmacist, the drug dealer. Okay, maybe not the drug dealer, that sounds bad since I'm African American. Okay, I'll be the doctor prescribing you some joy. So that's what I want you to do right now. 
write it down, one or two things, maybe three, if you're adventurous, that bring you joy and you do it this week. I know you can do it. I know, and I'm gonna, I am promise you, I'm gonna nap and cook and dance party all week long. I promise you that. And I will even try to find something else that brings me joy so I can do it along with you. Sound good? Okay, great. So write it down. Right, I'll wait for you. Go ahead, write it down. And I'm gonna think of something right now too. So let's all write it down. Let's see. What brings us joy? What brings us joy? Okay, I got some stuff. Did you get some stuff? Great. Go out and do it. And when you go out and do it, whatever joyful thing that you're doing, you know to make it great. So this morning, this evening, this afternoon, make it great. I am Andrew for Andrew Talks, joyful as ever, and I hope you are now that you've seen this episode. Go out, get you some joy, bring it back, and share it with others. Share it around the workplace too, because that's where the, oh, that's where some negativity is, right? Oh my God, oh, that boss that's getting on your nerves, yeah, mm -hmm, you know who I'm talking to. Yeah, bring that joy, bring the, bring the joy to work, make it a potluck, how about that? How about that? And a quick final shout out to all the teachers and students, um, if it's your first year of preschool, if it's your last year of college, and to everybody at uh, schools, universities, principals, to janitors, everybody, happy back to school, good luck, I hope you have a great year, we're almost there, don't forget to get your supplies at a local store to help the economy, whatever store you choose, maybe a store that has a bullseye, as a logo, whatever the case may be, you decide, and you go shopping and get, get the school supplies, maybe get a pen, get some paper, whatever you need, but um, shout out, shout out, shout out to all teachers, back to school, students, everybody. Good luck this year, I wish you the best. And that's it for me, for Andrew, I'm Andrew for Andrew Talks. I'll see you next time, bye, bye. Let's, you want to dance party out, let's dance party out. Do, 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 do. Hey, do, 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 do. find that joy, y'all. Find that joy, okay? Do, do, do. Dance party and out. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh, you weren't ready for it. Get low.